everyone welcome back to my channel or if this is your first time stopping by my channel welcome my name is Emily and thanks for stopping by this is my second video on my YouTube channel my first video I did a what I eat in a day video and it was all vegan food because I recently decided to go vegan and speaking of deciding to go vegan I figured I would do a video of why I did decide to go vegan but I don't know exactly what I'm going to title this. I will figure it out as I edit and upload this. So you will all find out. You probably all realize it now because you are all watching it, hopefully. But anyways, I will stop rambling. Before I get started with the video, I just wanted to let you all know I do have an Instagram, Vegan Life of M. Go follow me there. I am currently working on a blog. So stay tuned for that. I will keep you all updated when it goes live. And yeah, I'm thinking about possibly doing an ebook or like a fitness ebook because I am a certified personal trainer and nutrition coach. So yeah, if you all want me to do an ebook, leave comments down below of what type of ebook you would want to see or would like me to do. That would be greatly helpful. But yeah, I'm going to stop talking like randomly, like rambling on and on and get on with the video of why I decided to go vegan. So yeah, keep on watching and I hope you all enjoy. Give it a big thumbs up if you do and hit that subscribe button up. I wasn't always vegan. I would eat my cheese, meats, all those processed foods and I knew it wasn't healthy for me like as I got older but I still found myself in the same lifestyle routine of eating unhealthy not a lot of plant-based foods in my diet and I just want to say like as I got older and eating all of like the unhealthy based foods and all those processed foods, fast foods. I loved going to McDonald's. I was always on the go with college and sports. I would go to McDonald's, Wendy's. And as I got older, I feel like it qu definitely caught up to me because I was always tired and I just felt, I just wouldn't feel good after I'd eat those foods. And it honestly, took its toll on me and I knew I needed to do something to change how I was feeling and every single day I would be like okay I'll start this new lifestyle tomorrow tomorrow that tomorrow would, okay tomorrow would come and I would find myself doing the same habits going to fast food drinking a lot of carbonated drinks not drinking a lot of water and it just kept going on and on and on. Finally, about a year and a half ago, I was on a website and I forgot. I was on a YouTube, I was just on YouTube actually. I was on YouTube and I was looking at diff different videos and different YouTubers and I came across like fitness bloggers and healthy food bloggers and then I came across vegan bloggers. And I knew that there was like, I knew that vegan lifestyle existed, but I really didn't look into it. Like I didn't focus that much on it. And so I came across a couple of vegan vloggers. One of the vloggers recommended watching a couple documentaries and I wasn't really a big documentary person like I really I didn't really have I would always say I didn't have the time to like oh it's just an, another video like I don't need to watch it and then recently I put it off until the end of last year 2018 like December 2018 and I remember watching Cowspiracy and just watching that video it's it changed my life and my perspective of how I've been living and all the wrong things that I've been doing, like choosing in my lifestyle, food, 
just the environment and I knew I needed to make a change and after watching I watched Cowspiracy and Forks Over Knives and after watching those documentaries I knew that I have I had to change my lifestyle at right then and there and I wish I knew what I learned watching those documentaries years ago because I didn't realize how bad an, how bad of an effect making unhealthy choices can affect the environment, animals, and our lives as well. Eating a non-vegan based diet can decrease our overall health. It can increase cardiovascular problems, our blood pressure could go up, our sugars can go up. I have anxiety, a lot of anxiety, and I read on different blogs and from different books and watching different documentaries, like eating a plant-based diet can improve your overall health, including like helping with your anxiety. So I'm excited to see how eating this type of diet will help me with my anxiety and I can see already that it is definitely helping my anxiety is di diminishing day by day and I know it's not going to happen like overnight it's not going to improve drastically it's going to be a journey it's going to be a day by day thing and I feel like I'm rambling Okay, so I want to improve my overall health. I want to help animals all over the world. And I want to stop animal cruelty. So eating a more plant-based diet will definitely help that. And I just love animals and I don't want to see them suffer. They don't deserve to suffer. And they just deserve happiness and love. And I have a dog of my own and I just love animals and I don't want to see any animal in pain or suffering and they deserve to just live and yeah. And then for the environment, I feel that there is so much pollution and global warming and eating a more plant-based diet will definitely improve the overall environment. and. I feel like if a lot of other people joined this, if a lot of other people decide to go to a more vegan based diet, plant based diet, the overall environment will be a lot better. It's not going to happen overnight, but I feel like if one by one people eliminate eating animal based diets and processed foods and instead go to a more plant based diet it will benefit the overall environment so I am so excited to have decided to go vegan because I feel like I will hopefully improve my health improve the quality of the animals and the overall environment so I know this video is all over the place but I just want to share why I decided to go vegan and I know there's millions of other people out there that are vegan right now or are deciding to go vegan or they're not sure if they want to go vegan and I might share like why I decided to like I might share later on or in the near future a video of like the what ifs like my what ifs of going vegan like my doubts before I decide to go vegan and if you want me to post that video or do a video on that leave a comment down below and I will definitely film a video if you want me to do that one and yeah that is pretty much all that I have for today it is really 
nasty outside it is raining and so windy out so i hope you don't hear like all the wind and stuff in the background but i will keep my fingers crossed um yeah i hope this video comes out good because i feel like i rambled on all over the place so i guess i'll find out but yeah i hope you all enjoyed this video if you did be please give it a big thumbs up hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to get updates whenever i post a new video i do have an instagram i think i mentioned that earlier vegan life of m and i think that's it all right i will see you on my next video thanks so much for watching and yeah bye